World Skills is an international organization which brings together people from different countries who are members to come and take part in the skills competition. Judges who is the expert make sure that the, the competitors follow the laid down in procedures. When somebody attends this, that's a challenge. When they go back there, they will tell their friends to say, really, there are certain things that we are missing, which the world wants us to achieve. Mm -hmm. It's not just a question of reading from the books or doing some uh, small project. One has to be confident and competent in certain problems that goes on in um, different uh, on, on machines or earth moving equipment. A trainer should make sure that students achieve the goals as set into the manual of the particular machine. You cannot be a chief executive who doesn't understand the product of the organization. So if the chief executive would take part into this and would make sure that there are people are taking part in the world skills, here we are meeting certain goals. That's world standards. There is a standard in the world that people in certain skills should meet in order to do this. First, you have to be a member of the world skills. Second, there is some programs that you have to do. There are certain benchmarks which is set by World Skill, which as a competitor and an expert, you have to meet. It's not a question just coming. Mean, you have to meet certain benchmarks. At the same time, you have to train. The training, you need really, even in my part, I thought, I think we didn't do much. We need to do more. From what I've experienced here, I think the next time we'll be coming here, we we'll work hard. Uh, the coming of UNIDO has brought a lot of things. I've really upgraded myself in so many areas. Had it not been for UNIDO, I don't think I should have been here. But because of the skills that I've got through UNIDO program. I'm a trainer. So I've always tried to encourage and I'm always doing the same thing. And I'll keep on doing the same job that I do, training students. Because we don't only train them for employment, we train them also to be self to, to, to be self independent so that they can come up with their own workshops, do some work at home to sustain their living. 